Exactly, all over again. Getting a bronze, maybe even better than that, but in our, in our home games. Mm. Uh, here we go. From the start in lane one, Amelia Mazai, Alyssa Jordan, Stephanie Schweitzer, Kirsty Newcomb, Belinda Slatter, Tarita Blake, Jesse Venner, and Alicia Burt. And it's almost a race in two here. Um, I'm watching Elisa and Stephanie, and they've gone out really, really fast. And I think Stephanie knows that Elisa is a, a youngster on the rise, and she's gonna, she's got good leg speed, so she knows that she can't, she can't ease off at all around this 200 meter mark, and she's gone out pretty fast. So I think these these ladies could be in for a fast time here. Yeah, definitely. So Steph almost has to run, yeah, running scared, running blind with Alyssa on her inside. Probably the second fastest seed time in this race. So. A 64.45 for Alyssa and a 63 flat for Steph as they enter the home straight. That is Steph Schweitzer in the lead. Alyssa still not letting her get too far away. On the outside, Jesse Venner and Tarita Blake fighting home. It's going to be a very good finish here. Alyssa Jordan finding a little bit extra gear. Steph holding on. It's going to be very tight as they come to the line. But Steph Schweitzer, 62.64. So the girls pushing themselves to potentially... PB's all season best, and that's a great run. And isn't it fantastic? Because obviously they're in dis different classifications, but the fact that they're racing against each other has pulled out the best in both of them, and they've run a sensational time, and you can see with their faces that they're happy with that time. Perhaps not so happy with the pain of the 400 metres, but they're on their feet, and they're, they're um, recovering quite well. Yeah, definitely. I think... Uh like we said, we don't know who the winner is yet with the, with the classifications. We're not sure how to work it out, but excellent running there from Steph Schweitzer to take the win and take line honours and getting pushed all the way by the youngster, Alyssa Jordan. And 62 is a cracking time. Exactly. Looks like Ben... Has got the winner, Steph, with him. Hopefully it gives her a bit of time to catch her breath. <laughs> yep, yeah, down here with Steph. Taking line on us here in this 400 metres, how'd the run go? Talk us through it. Um, yeah, not too bad with that run. Um, I started, my start was better than normal, which was, uh, which was good. And I just tried to stay relaxed and calm down the back straight. And uh, I kicked a bit earlier than normal, um, more around the 150, 160, 150 mark. And, uh, and then just gave it whatever I had left. Uh, um, yeah, go on the inside. Gave me a run for it the last bit when the legs were feeling a bit jello. <laughs> now we have to obviously wait for the calculation to happen before we can obviously identify the places. But you had a win the other night in the 1500. It's a bit of a, in the 800. I'm sorry. It's a bit of a, a, an interesting double. Yeah. You do a, a number of different events. So which one is the main event? Um, look, the the 400 is the main because that's the one for my class for Tokyo. Um, but. I've been doing some eights because they got that at World Champs, but they don't have it at Tokyo. So just trying to a bit of work in the eights. Hopefully, he'll help my four. So talk us through the season. You've been out and competing in New South Wales a lot lately. You know, you get a lot of races in. How's the season sort of progressed and built up until this point? Uh, it's actually progressed uh, a lot. I I went through a bit of a rough patch through injury the last few years. So and uh, I was struggling even. Um, January this year, I've, I've come a long way, um, about like three, four seconds quicker in my 400 over in like a month, so yeah. Well, that's fantastic to see, fantastic to see. Now, we'll let you go and we'll obviously wait for the calculations to come through and hopefully not only do you take line honours, but you also come away with first place. Thank you, thanks very much. Thanks. There you can see that awesome finish at the end of that women's ambulance. 400 metres, very, very close. And hopefully we'll see these girls out here again over the next few days.